transfer deadline down, it probably looks like I haven't moved from this chair since every bloody video I've done on this channel recently. But I can't believe I'm about to say this because it just looked like nothing. There was just no news or anything at all. But it looks like Bertrand Traore has terminated his contract with Aston Villa and will be moving to Villarreal. Um... I'm a bit sad about this one, to be fair, because I feel like I want him on, my, on the bench like right now, because it's, you know, obviously today we, we've officially signed Morgan Rogers as well. To be fair, I did not know how tall he was, and I think that will help us, and obviously him in, in his game, you know, it's an advantage, to be fair, for a forward like him. So fair enough for Villa for getting that sorted. I'm absolutely buzzing with that one, but yeah, with Traore, I'm just a bit sad because, you know, I, was, I just thought, oh, he's in Africa and everything. Nothing will come come of this. Uh, there was no news or anything, but then again, you got to think like if he's not getting the game time, of course he's going to want to go and fair play to win for obviously terminating the contract as I've just seen on Twitter. Uh, moving to Villarreal team that probably will be using him quite regularly. Let's be honest. Um, yeah, it's a loss because you know his first season with us, obviously under Dean Smith as well. He scored like ten goals, some really big goals. Um, and obviously, the, probably the one goal he'll... Well, to be fair, there's two goals. The one against West Brom, the 3-0, which was beautiful that day. And uh, the one recently coming against Leicester. And, you know, it was the winner. And it's one of the reasons we're in Europe right now. So we, we've got to give this guy a bit of credit. And, yeah, I just wish him the best. And, you know, it is what it is. It, it happens in football. But it's not just the only news, obviously. We have signed Lino Sousa. I believe that's how you pronounce his name as well. And it looks like he will be going straight on loan to Plymouth Argyle, which I was a bit, I'm a bit worried about because you know he's 19, so it's not like he's too young to be in the prem or anything like as a backup. But he would have been perfect for uh, Alex Moreno because obviously Dina is injured. So you know I'm not too upset with it to be fair. I mean it'll be nice for him obviously to get some more game time come to uh, Villa next season, and probably will be the backup. For, our, for the left back position but you know hope it all goes well for him as well and I you know to end the video off it looks like Callum Chambers might be going I was just about to do a video um because I thought he would you know as soon as the news broke so I thought he would have been off to West Brom but it looks like he has rejected like three offers from three championship side, sides so I can't get my bloody words out um in my opinion West Brom would not be the worst because obviously it's up the road you know, a team that's obviously looking for promotion through playoffs, which is probably the best I can get right now. Um, yeah, I don't see why he wouldn't in a way, but we don't know who the, the other two clubs are. Like, it could be Southampton. He has been at Southampton before. It could be Swan Bigger. Who knows? But I think, it, you know, it has to be in the next few hours, to be fair, because it's, it's the deadline, isn't it? But I hope we can offload him as, as much as, like, you know, a loan would be good. And I'm not like saying, oh, just get him off the books or anything. I just, I think, you got to think for the, from the player's point of view, he's not getting any game time. So it would be the perfect opportunity for him to go into the championship because he will be used by another club. And um, yeah, he's obviously not being used by us at the moment. But yeah, let me know in the comment section what you think about this. I'm sure I'll be doing a video tonight talking about Callum James again. Probably won't be West Road, probably be somewhere else. But I do think he will be going probably on loan tonight but yeah we'll see what happens yeah up the villa the pride of villa we'll see you in the next video